Hey guys, my name is Scubby. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a zip, rar, and 7z files in Windows. This is going to be a nice quick and easy tutorial. I'm going to be showing you step by step how to do everything. Let's jump right into this. So right now I have a folder full with three different files. These are all just blank text documents. We're only going to be using them for example purposes. But I'm going to be showing you how to create a 7z from this file, a .rar from this file, and a .zip from this file. So I'm going to be starting out with a .zip as we can make .zips directly in Windows. We don't need any external software. It's really easy. To All we need to do is select a file or multiple files we would like to zip. In this case, I'm only going to be zipping one file. We're going to be right clicking. We're going to be going to send to and we're going to be going to a send to compressed or zipped folder. Now this is done directly in Windows. It'll create a zipped folder with the file inside and we can rename it if we wish. In this case, I'm not going to be renaming it. But right now we have our zipped file right here. Now to create a 7-zip or rar file we are going to need an external software and that's where 7-zip comes in right here just download whatever version best suits you if it's 64-bit or 32-bit whatever works for your pc just check that out if you want to see if your computer is 32-bit or 64-bit i'm going to leave a card on screen right now but once you've this downloaded we're going to be creating a 7z from these files so all you want to do is select a file or multiple files you want to use in this case i'm only going to be focusing on one we're going to be right clicking it we're going to be hovering over 7-zip and we're going to be adding it to a .7z right here. Click this and then it will create your .7z format. And if we right click and go to properties, we can see in details that it is a .7z file. So next thing we're doing is creating a .rar format. So for this, you are going to need WinRAR. I'm going to be leaving links to this in the description down below. This software comes with a 40 day free trial and it will keep asking you about the free trial, but you can continually use it even after that. So it's kind of one of those gray applications on the internet, but you can find links to this in the description down below also. So I'm going to be closing this down, but once you've WinRAR installed, we're going to be locating to wherever you have it installed. Currently, I made a shortcut on my desktop, but I'm going to be using this shortcut to open it up. So double click to open WinRAR and we're going to be left with this folder type application here. And I'm going to be dragging it down above our folder right here. So what I'm going to be doing is clicking into our folder, clicking into our path on the top, and I'm going to be copying this selecting our WinRAR again, and then pasting it into the path on top here by clicking in here, clicking Control and V and then enter, and it'll bring us to the same destination. From here, you want to select a file or multiple files you want to add to a .rar archive. In this case, I'm only going to be doing it for our rar.txt. I'm going to be clicking add on the top once you have your file selected. Then you're going to be selecting your archive format, which is going to be rar. And you can change any other settings in here that you wish. By default, all the settings should be fine. Click OK, and then your rar will be created. And as you can tell right now, we have 1.zip, we have 1.7z, and we have 1.rar file in this folder and everything works really well it works really easily for sending multiple files in one format or if you want to compress files and send them over facebook facebook won't additionally compress them so you won't lose the quality once they're uncompressed on the other side anyway guys it's that easy to create rare 7z and zip files in windows if you guys enjoyed this tutorial be sure to drop a like subscribe if you're new check out the other videos on the channel i'm gonna be leaving a link down below to my paypal if you found these videos helpful and you want to support me i make all these videos for free i always put the best quality in that i can i put a lot of time into this so if you want to support me to keep making videos be sure to check that out anyway guys thank you so much for watching until next time as always keep it saucy peace